Hi everyone, this is Srinivas. Welcome to Amirpe Technologies. So in this series, I'm going to start strings concept in Java. See, so what is a string first of all? String is a collection of characters or string is a sequence of characters. The characters means what? It can be an alphabet, it can be a digit or it can be a symbol. String can contains alphabets like a capital A to capital Z, lowercase alphabets, small a to small z. It can have digits 0 to 9 and symbols also like dollar, hash, all these things. A string, how can we represent? In string, here S should be capital letter string. Any variable name you can specify. Suppose S equals to. How can you represent the string means what? With double quotes. With double quotes. Right? For example, hello is a string. Hello is a string. Right? Not only characters. So mostly when we go with the all characters means what? Like to represent the string name. Name equals to, I am just specifying that name. For example, I just want to store a password equal to like ABC at the rate 1, 2, 3, some dollar. Password includes everything. Alphabets, symbols, digits. I just want to represent a mail ID. Mail ID, something like ABC at the rate gmail.com to represent all these things we are using strings and remember in java string is a class string is a class so what is class if you know object oriented programming right a class is the representation of object string is an object so it is providing so many methods to work with the strings. So many methods are there. Few things. This class, a string class providing so many methods. For example, length is one method. Just to find the length of the string. In coming concepts, I will explain. Then, if you want to display character at specified index, char at method if you want to split the string by specifying that delimiter any symbol we can use a split like that so many methods are there you know that class contains methods right by using the object nothing but by using that string object we can access all the methods this is the simple introduction if they ask what is string String is a collection of characters or string is a sequence of characters. Okay. How can you represent the string? Using double quotations, we represent the string in Java. Give me some examples where we use a string. Okay. I just want to write the name. Yes, we can use. I just want to specify the password which includes alphabets, digits and symbols. Next, I want to specify my mail ID, yes, which is also including, right, all the things, combination. String contains alphabets, digits and symbols. In string, S must be capital letter because it is a class in Java. Class is nothing but, is the representation of object. So, string also called object in Java. Generally, Class means a collection of variables and methods. Here so many methods are there. So what is the use? By using string methods, we perform operations on string. Just finding the length of the string. Next, just display a character at particular location. Split the string. Join the string. Right? Merging the strings. So many operations we can perform. All these operations I will explain in the coming concepts.
hope you understood the introduction part thank you all